Here's one. I, I wish there was better resolution on this projector. It's a beautiful picture from the Hubble Space Telescope of a distant galaxy far, far away and long, long ago. And, uh, and there's a whole galaxy. It's about a billion light years away. We're looking at it as it looked a billion years ago. So, so many of those stars no longer exist. And here's an object that's just a, a, as bright as the whole center of the galaxy. You think it's a star that's near in our galaxy that just got caught in the picture frame. It's not. It's a star on the edge of that galaxy that has exploded. And exploding stars shine with a brightness of 10 billion stars. They're the brightest fireworks in the universe, supernovae. And they're remarkable. And I, I keep having asides. Maybe I'll get to my point eventually. But um, the amazing thing is that every atom in your body came from a star that exploded. And the atoms in your left hand probably came from a different star than your right hand. It really is the most poetic thing I know about physics. You are all stardust. You couldn't be here if stars hadn't exploded because the elements, the carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, iron, all the things that matter for evolution weren't created at the beginning of time. They're created in the nuclear furnaces of stars and the only way they can get into your body is if the stars were kind enough to explode. So forget Jesus, the stars died so that you could be here today, okay? And, and anyway, this is great. Anyway, uh, so the, the point of, of the real point of what I, reason I showed this picture is that these objects, these exploding stars, are great standard candles. We can actually observe them amazingly, even though only one occurs every hundred years per galaxy. There are enough galaxies that if you put your hand up in the night in, away from LA, and looked in a dark spot in the sky and made a hole the size of a dime. With a large enough telescope, you could see 100,000 galaxies. And that means that even though stars explode once every 100 years per galaxy, in that little region with 100,000 galaxies, on a given night, you'll see 10 stars explode. The universe is huge and old, and rare things happen all the time, including life.